Once upon a time, there was a land. A land of misty mountains. Of castles on clouds. With a school under the ocean. And sparkling stars above. Where there lived an empress who loved stories. For she was the empress of Storyland. And in Storyland, Christmas was coming. And Christmas time meant a busy time for elves. Dilly-dally! Dilly-dally! Oh, where's that delivery elf got to? And no elf was busier than the big boss elf, Jiffy. That's me! I'm jolly important for fast, festive, yuletide deliveries. Or Jiffy just to keep things quick. And quick is what my delivery elf, Dilly-dally, needs to be. He should be back by now. Where is he? He's very, very late. He's very, very late. I told him to be early and I said I couldn't wait. This really isn't great. I told him very straight. Deliver all your parcels and be back by half past eight. Everybody's wish list must be wrapped and sent by Christmas and we really mustn't miss this, but he's very, very late. Hiya, Jiffy! <laughs> Who's late? Who's late? You are! Oh. Did you dilly-dally, dilly-dally? Dilly-dally? What's dilly-dally? Dilly-dally, dilly-dally is when you stop. Take it easy. Have a rest. Enjoy the view. But you wouldn't do that, would you, dilly-dally? Not when we need to make sure that everyone's got everything they need for another perfect Christmas in Storyland. Tell me you didn't dilly-dally, dilly-dally! Uh, of course I didn't! Dilly-dally was late because he dilly-dallied. OK, well, maybe I did stop a bit. Well, no more dilly-dallying. Let's get to work. We need to check everything's been delivered. Quick, quick, quickity quick! Be there in a jiffy, jiffy! <laughs> Christmas is coming! Quick, quick, quickity quick! Every December, we always remember to get our little list. We must double check it, we don't want to wreck it, let nobody be missed. So did you take a package of the armour to the knight? Dick! The trainers to the tortoise and the hare? Dick! Dick! Did you remember Goldilocks's porridge must be right? And Baby Bear? I sent another chair. The thread to the tailor, the ship to the sailor. I shipped it to the shore. Tick! Tick! To Mermaid a flipper, to Cinders a slipper. I slipped it through the door. Tick! We're stocking up your stocking, stocking up your stocking, stocking up your stocking with stuff. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle. I've crossed them off the list. The butcher, the baker, the candlestick maker. They'll none of them be missed. So did you take the blanket to the princess and the pea? Dick! Did you get Dick Whittington his cat? Dick! Cat! Dick! Did you get the jelly to the giant for his <laughs> tea? And send a sack of magic beans to Jack? We make it our business, delivering Christmas. Tomorrow is the day. From peasants to castles, the presents, the parcels, we send them on their way. We're stocking up your stocking, stocking up your stocking, stocking up your stocking with stuff! So just to double check, Dilly Dally, are you sure you delivered the magic beans to Jack? Tick! 
And you definitely delivered the porridge to Goldilocks. Tick! And you're absolutely positive that the Empress was happy with her delivery. <sighs> oh, no! Sorry! I forgot! You forgot? You forgot to deliver Christmas? To the Empress? You forgot to deliver the lights. Tick! You forgot to deliver the snow. Tick! You forgot to deliver the tree. Tick! The crackers are ready to go. Tick! Every December you've got to remember to tick every gift off your list. We must double-check it, we don't want to wreck it. The Emperor's mustn't be missed. Stop King up. A stocking wing. You've got to deliver the lights. Tick. You've got to deliver the snow. Tick. You've got to deliver the tree. Tick. The crackers are ready to go. Tick. Every, every December, December you've got, got to remember to tick every gift off your list. We must double check it. We don't want to wreck it. The Emperor's mustn't be missed. Stocking up a stocking wind. You've got to deliver the light. Tick. You've got to deliver the snow. Tick. You've got to deliver the tree. Tick. And the crackers are ready to go. Tick. Every December you've got to remember to tick every gift of your list. We must double check if we don't want to wreck it. The Emperor's must be missed. Stocking up a stocking wind. Stop. Right. Take all the presents. The lights, the snow, the crackers, the tree. Everything the Empress needs for a perfect Christmas. Off you go. And don't dilly-dally, dilly-dally. Tick. I'll be there in a jiffy, jiffy. Quick, quick. Quickly, quick. But what Dilly Dally did not know was that the journey would not go quite as planned. And so Dilly Dally set off to the palace to deliver Christmas to the Empress of Storyland. Whoa! It's a long way away. It was so far away that Dilly Dally decided to take a shortcut past the school under the ocean. Did I? How am I going to get down there? With a shake of his magic elf hat. Oh. The elf arrived at the school under the ocean. Wow, fancy that! I didn't know I could do that. <laughs> And I didn't know a manta ray could play the saxophone! Oh. Come and jam with us! <sighs> OK, just a quick boogie, then I'll be on my way. Glass? Freeze? <laughs> like fish fingers? Who's that? That's our teacher, Professor Lobster. Watch out, she can get a bit crabby. Oh. <laughs> I can hear you, Jelly Jellyfish, and I'll have you know I'm a lobster, not a crab. I can walk forwards for starters. <laughs> I'm OK! <laughs> now, come on, everyone, settle down. Take your seats, please. I know it's Christmas, but this is a classroom, not a Christmas disco. Aww. Put your hand down, Nacho. Questions at the end of class. And your other hand. And your other hands. And, Twinkle, don't you know it's rude to point? Oh, Professor, he can't help it. He's a starfish. That's what they do. Fair enough. Good point, Ray. <laughs> Good point, point, like a starfish. <laughs> now, come on, everyone, settle down. You two, funny fish, bottoms on seats, please. Sorry, Prof. Shame about the disco. Well, I'm sorry, but this is a classroom. It's just not set up for a disco. Oh. We'll just have to carry on with schoolwork over Christmas this year instead. <laughs> As you know, we've got a lot of catching up to do this year. But we've got a stage for the band. Have we? Where? Over there. And of course, we've got the music. 
true, but do you know what every good disco needs? <laughs> Apples? Baked beans! Lights! We simply cannot have a disco without lights. Oh. But where are we going to find disco lights on Christmas Eve? Yes, funny fish? Oh, I think I might be able to help. My stocking's stocked with stuff. I'm supposed to deliver these lights to the Empress of Storyland, but I'm sure she won't mind. She'll still have all the other stuff. Please, Please Professor! Professor. Oh, I'm not sure about this. It's been a long time since I broke out my disco moves. Ooh. I'm OK! Oh, please, can we have a Christmas disco, Professor? You'll love it. It'll probably make you feel less crabby, too. I'm not a crab. I'm a lobster. Suddenly, everyone looked up and saw the Christmas light flashing off and on, just like disco lights. It was time for a Christmas disco. Hit it! a great song! Oh, and I like the little bells at the end. There aren't any little bells at the end. Uh -um. Oh, hey, Big Boss Jiffy. Have you come for the disco too? No, I haven't. And I hope you're not disco dancing when you should be delivering everything to the Empress for a perfect Christmas. Of course not. But Dilly Dally had to admit that was exactly what he was doing. Do I? OK, yes. That was exactly what I was doing. Sorry, Jiffy. Well, as long as you've still got all the Christmas stuff you're supposed to deliver, I guess there's no harm done. Oh, yeah. Well, just about. <laughs> Jolly good. Now off you go, and no more dilly-dallying, dilly-dally. I'll be there in a jiffy, jiffy. Quick, quick. Quickity-quick. Bye, everyone. 
Happy Christmas! Happy, Happy Christmas! Christmas! So with another shake of his magic elf hat, Dilly Dally continued on his way. Dilly travelled on through Storyland, where everyone was busy getting ready for Christmas. But Dilly Dally still had a long way to go before he got to the Empress's Palace. Oh, but I told Jiffy I'd be there in a jiffy. I know, my magic hat. I can just ring the bell and I'll be there in no time at all. But the magic hat didn't always work. What? Why? It just didn't. Hmm. I'm beginning to think you're making this story up as you go along. Suddenly, Dilly Dally was interrupted by the sound of trumpets. Coming from the castles on clouds. Your Majesty! Oh, my brother and I are so happy and honoured to finally have you here for a visit! <laughs> my sister's right. At last, you can collect the Christmas cake that you like so, so much, Your Majesty. <laughs> Your Majesty? Oh, you haven't changed a bit, Your Majesty. <laughs> well, apart from the elf clothes. And the elf ears. And the elf shoes. It's not him, is it? No. Hi, I'm Dilly Dally the Delivery Elf. Who did you think I was? We were hoping you were our Grand Old Gramps the King. It's been ages since we've seen him and Grand Old Gram the Queen up close. <gasps> oh, look! There they are! Hi, Grand Old Gramps and... Hi, Grand Old Gran! We've got the Christmas cake for you! Your Majesties! How are you going to get the Christmas cake all the way over there? Behold! My latest invention! The cake up altar. The prince and princess had tried all sorts of ways to get a Christmas cake to their grandparents. But so far, none of them had worked. Oh, grand, oh, grand! I think our Christmas wishes are going to come true after all! It looks like we are going to get a Christmas cake this year! I think you're right, Grand Old Gramps. It looks so good. I can almost taste it. Dark! Oh, oh Grand Old Bother! I don't think a cake of polter is necessarily the best plan. Leave it to me, Grand Old Gramps. Yahoo! Don't stop cake of polting cakes. What was that? Sounds like, don't stop cake up all tin cakes. Ah, well, then this calls for more cakes. <laughs> Incoming! <laughs> oh. Oh. Look, there must be a way to get across to their cloud and deliver the cake yourselves. There isn't. We've tried everything. We try cake upholting and even pole vaulting and catching the cake in a net. Zoomed off on a plane, but it started to rain and the paper got soggy and wet. A journey we'll never forget. We still haven't managed it yet. Oh, oh Christmas has got, got to be Christmas. Christmas. Though we miss you, we miss you, and, and we've missed you, you all year. year. This Christmas has got, got to be Christmas. Christmas. Though we miss you, we miss you, and, and 
we wish you, we wish you were here. We try trampolining, but you must be dreaming to think that a jump is enough. Instead of a wagon, we flew on a dragon. The takeoff was ever so rough. And sadly, it ran out of puff. And that's why we're finding it tough. Oh, Christmas has got to be Christmas. Though we miss you, we miss you, and, and we've missed you all year. This Christmas has got to be Christmas. Christmas. Though we miss you, we miss you, and, and we, we wish you, we wish you were here. Oh, I wish, I wish, I wish I could help you. And just then, Dilly Dally's wishes came true. He came up with a brilliant plan to help. Oh, yes, I can help! <laughs> oh, <laughs> um, what's the plan? Your stocking. My stocking! It's stocked full of stuff that might help. <laughs> oh, yes! <laughs> um, the tree. The tree! Oh, <laughs> the, the tree? tree? <laughs> Well, I never! A bridge made from a Christmas tree. Why didn't we think of that? Excuse me, Christmas cake coming through. Ooh. I may have overdone it with the marzipan. Don't worry, dear. You can use my antique cake trolley. Ooh. Go careful with it. It's very valuable. Christmas is going to be Christmas. How we missed you, we missed you, and we wish you were here. Oh, Christmas is going to be Christmas. How we missed you, we missed you. Now Christmas is Christmas. Delicious Christmas cake, don't you agree, Gramps? Oh, I do, my dear. Thank you, you two. Happy Christmas. Happy, Happy Christmas. Christmas. Thanks so much for your help, Dilly Dally. Would you like to stay for some Christmas cake, too? There's plenty to go round. Oh, thank you, Your Majesty. Oh. I'd love to. But I need to deliver Christmas to the Empress. <gasps> the Empress? Oh, there must be all sorts of stuff on her Christmas list. Crackers, snow, a tree. Oh, that's funny. That's a sound my big boss Jiffy's hat makes when she's... She's behind me, isn't she? Uh -huh. <sighs> what did I say about not dilly-dallying, dilly-dally? You've got a stocking full of Christmas to deliver to the Empress! Well, half full anyway. What's that? Um, nothing! Quick, quick! Quick, quick, quick! <clears throat> Do you mind? And so Dilly Dally continued on his way to the Empress's palace. Bye, everyone! Happy Christmas! Happy, Happy Christmas! Christmas! It's lovely making people happy at Christmas, but that really does have to be the last thing I give away. Jiffy's right. No more dilly-dallying. No more stopping. Suddenly, Dilly Dally found himself at a stop sign. Huh? Up ahead, some space protectors were hard at work. 
protecting the planets and making the stars shine. Oh, well, I hope they won't be long. It was an important job clearing up the junk that littered the planet. And of course the stars needed looking after too. Excuse me. I'm in a bit of a hurry. But the space protectors couldn't open up the way again until the stars had been given back their twinkle. And nothing seemed to be working. Maybe the problem isn't that they need dusting. Maybe they're not twinkling because they're not happy. If only Dilly Daddy could find a way of cheering them up. My stocking stocked with stuff that can help, isn't it? cheer people up. They're a Christmas party in a box. Oh, look! There's even a kazoo inside this one. set off on his journey to the Empress's palace. And I'll go straight there this time. We'll see. You were very quiet. Couldn't think of anything to say. There it is. Empress, I'm on my way. Did you just hear something? Oh, it's probably nothing. 
Did you hear it that time? Oh, I really shouldn't dilly-dally. <laughs> but one last stop can't hurt. Yeti Yodel, who? Hey! Hello? Oh, uh. Yeti Yodel, hi! Hiya, Yeti! Yeti Yodel, who? That means Happy Christmas in Yeti! Oh, I'll give it a try. Yeti Yodel, who? Uh, don't worry, I'll teach you! The mountain where you met me And learn to yodel Etty with a Yeti So sprinkle some confetti I know you won't regret -y. The funny festive feeling that you get -y. Give a Yeti yodel yodel on lee Give a Yeti yodel yodel on la Give a Yeti yodel Lady yodel lady yodel lady yodel lady yodel lady yodel lady la Give a Yeti yodel yodel on lee Give a Yeti yodel yodel on la Give a Yeti yodel lady yodel lady yodel lady yodel lady loo Yodel on lee Yeti yodel odel who It's a tricky thing to get -y, to yodel like a yeti. So if you're feeling fretty or upsetty, <laughs> then jump up off your settee and practice till you're sweaty. And soon you'll find the tune of a duetty. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on lee. Give a yeti yodel, yodel la la. Give a yeti yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady la. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on lee. Give a yeti yodel, yodel la la. Give a yeti yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady loo. Yodel on lee, yeti yodel, odel who. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on lee. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on la. Give a yeti yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady la. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on a lee. Give a yeti yodel, yodel on a la. Give a yeti yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady yodel, lady loo. Yodel on a lee, yeti yodel, odel, yodel on a lee. Yeti yodel, odel, 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 yodel on a lee, yeti yodel, odel who. Yeti yodel who. <laughs> oh, well. I've helped so many people in Storyland, but you clearly don't need any help. <laughs> Happy Christmas. Or should I say, Yeti Yodel? Yeti Yodel? <laughs> Are you okay? Oh, yes, I'm fine. Happy Christmas! Happy Christmas! <laughs> oh. Are you sure you're fine? Kinda sounds like you might not be. <laughs> I'm fine. It's just sometimes people say they're fine because they don't want to bother people, when really they're not fine at all. Oh, <laughs> not me. <laughs> I'm great. <laughs> Woohoo! Great. Then I'll be on my way. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you tell me all about it? Well, there's so much to do up here in the mountains, but it's no fun doing it all on your own. Don't you have any friends? Well, I used to. Oh, we did everything together. And then one day, they just vanished. Gone. Oh, that is strange. Look. Here's a picture of them. We had such great times. Did they happen to disappear on a hot day? Well, that's right. You see, I went to get everyone some suntan lotion, and when I got back, they vanished. Got on. Dilly Dally realised 
that Yeti's friends must have melted, and there was no way of bringing them back. Unless someone happened to have a big jar of snow in their stocking. Oh, but... I can't. This is the last thing I've got left to give to the Empress. <laughs> <laughs> it was a tough decision, but Dilly Dally knew it was the right thing to do. I think I've got something stocked in my stocking to help. Woohoo! Here, it's time to get your friends back. <sighs> oh, look, it's snowing! Yeti Earth! Oh, hooray! Snowflake? <gasps> Icicle! You're back! Oh, come here! <laughs> oh, you're so cold! Give me Yeti Yodel! Give me Yeti Yodel! Yodel, yodel, Give me Yeti Yodel! Lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, Give me Yeti Yodel! Give me Yeti Yodel! Yodel, yodel, Give me Yeti Yodel! Lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, yodel, lady, Oh, ah, I'm dilly dallying again, aren't I? <laughs> Come on, I'll take you there myself. We've got a delivery to make. Quick, quick, quickly, quick. Uh, yes, about that delivery. No more. Dilly dally. Goodbye, Yeti. Uh, goodbye. Uh, stop by any time. Happy Christmas. Yeti Yodel. Oh. Come on, let's wave. <laughs> <laughs> um. Quick, quick. Quickity quick. Yes. Uh... To the palace. Right! Leave this to me. Um, you see, the thing is, Jiffy, I've got something to tell you. <laughs> and that's why I haven't got anything left to give her. What? Sorry. I don't know how to say this, but... Dilly Dally's stocking was empty. He'd given everything away and had nothing left for the Empress of Storyland. Um, well, yes, that. I'm going to... I'm going to... I'm going to... What are we going to do? Maybe we'll be lucky. Maybe she's out. <laughs> yes. She's probably not even in. <laughs> um, she's behind you. You nearly got me there. But she is. She's behind you. OK. I'll check one more time. Now look, we've all had a long day and we're all a little bit worried. So please don't play jokes! But she really is behind you. Oh no, she isn't. Oh yes, she is. 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 Oh, yes, she is. Hello. Happy Christmas. It won't be happy when she finds out we can't deliver Christmas. Maybe she'll understand. And maybe she'll have our tinkly hats for this. Oh, now that's an idea. Let's tinkle our way out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
But the magic elf hats didn't work because the batteries had run out. Thanks for nothing. Well, where's my Christmas? <laughs> well, you see, the thing is... Let it's... me tell her. It's all my fault. The thing is... And so, Dilly Dally told his story to the Empress of Storyland. Who listened... And listened... And listened. Young Elf was finally finished. And that's why we can't deliver Christmas. <gasps> Sorry. You shouldn't blame Dilly Dally. I'm in charge. If it's anyone's fault, it's mine. Fault? Blame? What strange words to use. But we didn't deliver you any of the Christmas stuff you ordered. But you've given me a Christmas story I will remember forever. What could the Empress of Storyland want more for Christmas than a story? And it's the story of the happiest Christmas in Storyland. First, you delivered the fun. A Christmas for everyone. The laughter and joy that you bring The friends and the songs that they sing Every December it's good to remember There's presents more precious than stuff Kindness and caring, compassion and sharing These gifts are much more than enough Stocking up the stocking It was the happiest Christmas in Storyland. Stocking up your stocking with... Love. The end. Love you, Yeti. Night night, lobster. Are you settling down to sleep, Joanne? Yes, Gran. It's the big day tomorrow. I love you, Gran. Oh, I love you too, Joanne. Happy Christmas Eve. Yeti Yoda. Give me Yeti Yoda, Yoda, Lee. Give me Yeti Yoda, Yoda, Lee. Yeti Yodel, 